now today i will focus on determine v not okay that is v not so how can we determine v not you can use lot of method current division rule r nodal analysis r kvl kcl mesh analysis okay but today i will solve this question with the help of source transformation okay so how can you use source transformation i know that if voltage is given like that one okay and here a resistance is with series like that one here r here v and that one is x and y terminal so this one is converted into current source i like that one okay and resistance connected this resistance connected to parallel to current source okay that is r and here x here y and what about i i is basically v by r and if current is given r is a parallel to a current i then what about v v this be equal to i r it means you can that is source this is called source transformation source transformation this is the powerful tool to solve lot of problem okay with the help of this tool in very in very easy way so how can you use this tool okay here now look that one that is 20 kilo ohm written like that one and that one is plus minus how much 12 volt okay and that one is 30 kilo ohm and that one is 40 kilo ohm and that one is how much given 20 kilo ohm clear or not and this one okay so using here source transformation let this is x that is x and that one is y terminal okay if apply this one then we got then we got here a current source represent like that one like that one here i what about i i this is equal to v by r so 12 divided by 20 12 divided by 20 i is 12 divided by 20 that is 4 by 5 sorry 3 by 5 that is 3 by 5 milliampere okay this one is written as 3 by 5 milliampere because of here volt here kilo ohm that's why okay so 3 by 5 milliampere after that that one is written 20 kilo ohm after that this is x and that is y clear or not okay if in doubt then comment it i will discuss again after then attached to the circuit this is 30 kilo ohm and that is 40 kilo ohm and this one is 20 kilo ohm okay here plus minus 
बी जीरो क्लियर नाउ आफ्टर दैट अगेन अप्लाई सोर्स ट्रांसफॉर्मेशन और इफ यू लुक हियर इफ यू लुक हियर दीज टू दीज टू दिस वन एंड दिस वन आर पैरल ओके इफ दीज टू आर पैरल तो पैरल कॉम्बिनेशन ऑफ दीज टू वी गॉट ट्वेंटी इंटू थर्टी डिवाइडेड बाई फिफ्टी तो वी गॉट सिक्सटी डिवाइड बाई फाइव ओके क्लियर आर नॉट एंड दैट इज ट्वेल्व किलो ओम ओके सो फाइनली दैट वन इज थ्री बाई फाइव किलो सॉरी मिलियम पी एर एंड दैट वन ट्वेल्व किलो ओम एंड ट्वेंटी किलो ओम दैट इज फोर्टी किलो ओम इयर प्लस माइनस वी नॉट ओके नाउ अगेन अप्लाई वोल्टेज डिविजन रूल सॉरी सोर्स ट्रांसफॉर्मेशन प्लस माइनस और यू कैन से दैट दैट इज ए टर्मिनल एंड दैट इज बी टर्मिनल हियर ए एंड हियर बी ओके सो थ्री बाई फोर थ्री बाई फाइव इंटू ट्वेल्व थ्री बाई फाइव इंटू ट्वेल्व इज इक्वल टू थर्टी सिक्स बाई फाइव ओके दैट इज थर्टी सिक्स बाई फाइव और यू कैन से दैट सेवन पॉइंट टू वोल्ट एंड दैट वन इज ट्वेल्व किलो ओम आफ्टर दैट दैट इज फोर्टी किलो ओम and that one is how much 20 kilo ohm and that is v not clear or not now after that 12 plus 40 that is 42 sorry 12 plus 40 That is fifty-two kilo ohm. Okay, and this one twenty kilo ohm, and that one represent seven point two volt. that one represent plus minus seven point two volt okay and that one is v not now look using voltage division rule v not is written as seven point two into twenty divided by Sum of these two, fifty-two plus twenty. Then we got seventy-two. So seven point two into twenty divided by seventy-two. Then we got two volt. Is the right answer? 
so which option is correct option a is the correct option okay make it if in doubt then comment it you can solve lot of problem but lot of method but if you use those transformation okay the more effective method <laughs>